Welcome to Cypress Automation. This is Shurful. Today we're going to learn some sort of comparison between Cypress and other automation tools, which is the the famous one is the Selenium. We all know Selenium is very stable, it's been a decade in the automation world. So why Cypress on the top? Why you you know you need to choose Cypress? Why Cypress is growing? So we need to know the difference between Cypress and Selenium. So this tutorial it's all about the differentiated between Cypress and Selenium. Let's go. So here is a, a key point you can see a number up to number nine. You know I found some of the very important key points uh, that will give you the actual difference between Selenium and Cypress. Number one architecture. Selenium architecture is based on driver or server. So it means we all know that so we need a jar for some when you you know uh, uh, build a Selenium architecture or framework you know so it's based on driver so or server so driver works as a middle server between your script and a browser on the other hand Selenium uh, Cypress doesn't need any server the script directly talked with the server I'm sorry talked with the browser number two supported language Selenium has a wide range of supported language which is a Java, JavaScript, C, C Sharp, Python, Ruby and so on but Cypress is very limited to only JavaScript. Selectors to select any web element Selenium is give you lots of attribute or um, web element property which is name, ID, class name, link text, text, um, uh, tag name, CSS selector and uh, XPath on the other hand Cypress is also very limited to jQuery which is CSS selector framework support Selenium support multiple frameworks since it support you know a number of uh, um, uh, br a number of languages so that's why it's give you also lo lots of option in terms of framework so based on the programming language which is example JUnit for Java we all know the keyword driven or data driven you know uh, as well as cucumber for JavaScript and the Cypress um, it's built in it's called the Mocha JavaScript based on JavaScript Node.js JavaScript um, but uh, recently it's very um, interesting that uh, Cypress is uh, uh, supporting cucumber so you can do a BDD frameworks based on Cypress too in terms of speed Selenium is slow because Selenium is it, it has a lot of dependency it needs a driver as a middleman and then also a lot of other dependency you need so that's why Selenium is it's kinda slow as well as complex structure but other hand Cypress is very fast and it's easy to uh, you know set up the framework screenshot we all know Selenium support screenshot but you have to do it by coding but Cypress is a de by default features the screenshot is a by default features so you don't have to do any coding video recordings Selenium doesn't have such kind of features that can help you to record your testing your execution but on the other hand Cypress it's supported Cypress has a very powerful and awesome features or you can say uh, web features uh, which is called uh, dashboard and dashboard it comes to the one of the very beautiful features it's uh, recorded your script so your all execution will be recorded automatically you don't have to do any any uh, you know coding for this so you it comes with the features so all you have to just open an account and and you know integrate with your uh, code they will give you they uh, it will give you some sort of key and ID you have to put on your uh, script so that it can understand you know so what script needs to uh, need to record it and it will be recorded up there your whole script so it's a very powerful especially if you have a failure uh, test cases that you need to debug it you can see the video including the screenshot so this is very very uh, helpful and this is very milestone uh, features I would, I would say in terms of uh, you know the automation that only Cypress can provide there is no other such automation tool can give you that kind of features next one mobile app 
Selenium support Android iOS automation. We all know. But Cypress, still we haven't seen uh, any uh, mechanism or engineering that Cypress can help you, can do any automation in terms of mobile app. But I think it's, uh, pretty soon it will come up. The community support, yes, Selenium is very strong, you know, so in terms of community uh, support. Uh, it So Selenium is a very well established as, as we know it's been a, a decade in the market so it has very well established documentation and firm community support from user across the globe. Other hand Cypress is just growing it's called next generation automation so it's rapidly going uh, growing community you know so it's a lot of documentation now available every day the new uh, support is coming up lots of resources is building so its community is growing very rapidly okay so that's all the main features you know on the other hand the setup complexity I would say you know Selenium is a, it's kind of complex uh, in terms of uh, set up the framework but Cypress is very straightforward so there is a lot of others, you know, differentiate or comparison, uh, comparison you can do between Selenium and Cypress, but I would say those are the these nine points are the main. Okay, so based on now you can decide, you know, what tool or automation you need to go for your company for your learning perspective. I hope this helped you. Thank you so much, and uh, we'll see you on next uh, tutorial.